Hi, my name is TB from Sensorica. I'll show you how to connect the drop sensor. This is a drop counter. What you have here is a series of four LEDs and phototransistors. Okay, the dark ones are the phototransistors and the lighter ones are the LEDs. So you have two LEDs on each side and two phototransistors one two one two on the other side now the red wires that come out of this you have them two by two connected okay so on this side here you have the two phototransistors connected together the red wire into one red wire and the two red wires from the LEDs are connected to another red wire and the same thing on the other side okay so the red wires they go two by two on each side the black wires which is the ground are all connected together four from here and four from here into one wire and then you get the four wires one two three four which are white one for each photo detector okay each photo detector has one white wire and i'll show you where they go okay so let's start with the white wires the white wires they go here one two three four all the white wires it doesn't matter which order you plug them in okay so this is the electronic board now all the black wires they go here and you see this little guy here okay has four holes and it's all connected to one green wire that is the ground for the entire thing now let's look at the LEDs one two there's one wire that goes out and you plug it here and the other one from the other side from the LEDs one two the LEDs are the clear ones you're gonna plug them in the second hole so this little thing here has two holes you plug two LEDs and two LEDs this is a potentiometer and you use it to vary the intensity of the LED in order to get closer or further from the threshold of HME trigger here this is very important to adjust the device to make it sensitive to the drop. Okay, now this is the plus in that goes voltage in 5 volts and it's connected to a 4 holes input here uh, and you're going to use only 2 of them and you're going to plug in here the um, detectors. Uh, sorry, the detectors are the dark ones so one, two, three, four. They're paired by two. So you have two red wires here that go from this one and this one plugged into one single wire. Same thing here. The two wires, this and this red, they go into another red wire. So you have one wire from here, one wire from there, and you plug them in here. Okay. So all these red wires, two of them, you plug them here from the detectors. Two of them, you plug them here from the LEDs and you adjust the intensity of LEDs, the LEDs using this potentiometer. Then you plug this into the 5 volts of the Arduino, you plug this green wire here into the ground of the Arduino and you plug the um, blue wire into the interrupt uh, pin of the Arduino. There you go, three wires out, red, blue and green 5 volts in data to the interrupt and the ground okay and the way you plug this in here leds go here detectors go there and the white cables the white wires which are the data from each detector they go into one of these things it doesn't matter which way order signal goes in goes to a schmidt trigger goes to a logical or gate and then it goes all one wire out to the interrupt of the Arduino. Thank you very much and have fun with it.